Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to World of Warcraft. So, while I sit here, you are going to go and carry on where you left off last time. Enjoy! Our world is in danger, Grondorn. We need the help of great heroes like you to save it. Thank the spirits you're here, Grondorn. We're not sure how much longer we can maintain the rift in the Maelstrom. Our most powerful members, led by Thrall, are barely preventing the tear. Last I heard, our only hope was to go through the breach and attempt to stabilize it from the other side. I will conjure a portal. Take it and report to Thrall as soon as you can. You'll come back sometime. You'll come back sometime. Okay, I will come back. The Call of the World share. I don't know what those two are. I think they're something Roma. different. Hecht Corta. I don't think they're anything that we need to worry about. We've got that, and we need to go and speak to Thrall, so we will take those. We won't worry about the other ones. I think they are unrelated to this. So here is the Maelstrom, which is this bit here. That's so cool, isn't it? Is that... Oh. It's not there. This, this, this is different. This is the Maelstrom. This is right in the middle of the ocean. Okay? We've just got this big pit... In the middle of the ocean with nothing else here. There is Agra of the Earthen Ring. And there is a Wyvern right there. And there. This has been caused by Deathwing. The Cataclysm and by Deathwing stirring deep under the ground. And look at that. That is absolutely awesome. I love this. Oops. No, I don't want weapons. You know, I'm just thinking. This is the sort of situation where I would come along and I would test to see what would happen if I would fall in there before I speak to Thrall. So let's just run it. Oh. <laughs> I went to jump and it won't let me. Right. They've, all, they, they've already prepared for people like me. Let's speak to Thrall a minute. Look tar, friend. Look tar. What is it you wish? Thrall's muscles strain as primal energy flows through him. His eyes shift your way, acknowledging your arrival. It is good to see you, Grundorn. Lothar, friend. What is it you wish? I knew you'd heed our call, Grundorn. When Deathwing was first defeated by the other dragon aspects, he retreated to Deepholm, the realm of Earth. Deathwing's return to our world left a rift open between Azeroth and Deepholm. If we don't mend the breach, this land will be torn asunder. We're doing our best to contain the damage on this side of the rift. Agra will take you through the rift so you can help repair the damage from the other side. Get on her wyvern when you are ready. Okay. Those of you who don't know, Agra right there is Thrall's wife. Jump onto the wyvern. And I hope in. you have a strong stomach. Traveling through the breach is not for the weak. I can't, I can't move the camera around. It's We're a bit at of the a shame. center of the maelstrom, the rift between Deepholm and Azeroth. Watch as it threatens to tear your world apart. Let us hope Thrall and the others can contain it while you're inside. This is it. Brace yourself. Okay. She didn't fly us through. She just dumped me off. Sure, I like that. You made it. I this did. is the Temple of Earth. Oh, it's she the didn't. most important structure in Deep Home. There was once a Titan made stone inside. It was known as the World's Pillar. The name was literal. It bore the weight of all the elemental and magnetic forces in Deep Home. It was shattered when Deathwing broke through the dome above and created the rift between the two worlds. All of Deep Home is going to collapse into Azeroth if we do not put the World Pillar back together. The first fragment was going to be delivered to us by a Horde gunship known as the Storm's Fury. It never made it here. We've taken control of the temple, and we're containing as much of the damage as we can. Go inside and speak to Marut. 
He's in charge. We are all counting on you. No pressure or anything. No pressure, but uh, they're all counting on me to rebuild the entire world. Once again, I have things expected of me that aren't normally expected of a lot of people. Marut Stonebinder. What brings you here? You've arrived just in time, Grundorn. All our resources are tied up keeping the rift stable. We need someone like you to help us recover the fragments of the world pillar. The arch stone was being transported inside a flying horde gunship called the Storm's Fury. The airship crashed south of here and our scrying has revealed the arch stones no longer on it. Search the ship for clues related to what might have happened. We shall meet again. Right, I can set my hearthstone to in here, and then we've got a, a hero's call board, and then there's a portal to Stormwind right there. It's actually really quick and easy to get back to Stormwind, so we will just do that a minute before we do anything else. I know I set it to Stormwind. Um, yeah, I think I'd actually rather just set it over here. So if I go... Leave another day. Leave another day. Yes, I would like to make this my home. And then we'll come back over here. What you need, stranger. What you need, stranger. We cannot fail, Grandorn. The future of multiple worlds is at stake here. It's taking every ounce of our power to keep this realm stable in the absence of the world pillar. As shaman, we can tap directly into the energies of the elementals that inhabit Deep Holm and use them to heal the damage that the rift is causing. Take this totem and place it on the ground outside. Any energized geodes or lodestone elementals destroyed in its proximity will fill it with the energy we require. Tuval has come online. We're in the plane of Earth, Grundorn. Everything is absorbed by the land eventually. The storm's fury will soon be turned to dust, and we won't be able to gain any insight from its remains. Go and destroy the elementals that are dismantling the ship. We're only delaying the inevitable, but we need to buy ourselves some time if we're to track down all the pieces of the world pillar. So long. I can do that, and... Each day is a blessing. We must do whatever it takes to recombine the fragments of the world pillar. But first, we must regain all of them. My goblin initiate has been gone for quite some time. His name is Goldmine. I sent him out to observe the local rock flayers southwest of the quartzite basin. Perhaps you would be willing to find him? When you do, please ask him to come back to the temple. I have a contingent of the Explorers League in the chamber just to the northwest inside the temple. They have been making increasing noises about something that the Twilight's hammer is up to. Grondorn, would you be a deer and see what they need? Seek the path of the light. Seek the path of the light. Okay, let's go in here and just have a little chat with these guys first. Deep Holmes Sanctuary. My, you're a tall one. My, you're a tall one. Oh, gosh. Someone's finally here to help us. We came to investigate rumors of Titan Artifact up at the Master's Gate to the southwest. One of those Twilight Hammer, Twilight's Hammer cultists <laughs> must have the plans for what they're doing up there. You're going to have to get them for us, Grondorn. Keep searching the cultists until you find them. <laughs> All right, Explorer Maui. How is it that the... Gnomes always have really dangerous things for us to go and do. There's a, a mailbox right there. How are you? How are you? I tried to fly over the terrace and have a look for myself, but those toasty eating pansies, toasty eating pansies, <laughs> kept shooting at me and I couldn't get near. You look like you might be handy with the reins. Why don't you take your flying beastie up there to the southwest and see what all the fuss is about? See you soon. Right. 
Oh, we'll do what we can. So we've got several quests already that we can go racing off and take care of. So we're kind of running out here. And we will now switch over to an actual flyer. Corrupted Dreadwing. I like this one. And we've so we've got a daily quest out here. This is this is a, a pet battle though, so we're gonna ignore that one. Um, I haven't gained any new mounts for quite some time because I haven't actually played this game in my spare time for quite some time, which I was doing um, several months ago now. Uh, but I, yeah, personal reasons, I've not been able to. And I do keep saying, and I do keep apologising and saying, and I will come back and I will do it. I will eventually, right? It, it, we all know that I will eventually, but um, yeah, at the moment I haven't really been doing it. Uh, so for totems. We'll do this one here. We will, we'll, we'll energize the totem. So you bring that one down there like that and we get that guy out. Don't drag me over this way. I want you to come over that way. Energize geode. I don't know if it's both of them, if it's a lodestone or if it's just just the energized geode. I can't really say on either of them. So we'll, we'll take both of these down a minute. There, like that. Throw me around an awful lot. Yeah, there's one. Totem energized times one. So do the lodestone ones count as well, or is it just the the shiny? Nope, the lodestone ones do count. Right, so we can pick that up. But because we've got elementals here and we've also got mining, we're able to mine just about everything we kill in this zone. And that is one thing that's quite cool. If you've got mining, you're able to harvest a lot of stuff in here. You don't get, like, really massive amounts of stuff with your harvesting of them but you do get some stuff and it is it, it is quite cool right i'll take you over there uh yeah i want that one as well and uh i want to drop that down there okay and then Oh, uh, let's, let's just do that a minute, and, and we'll heal up a little bit. We're, we are taking a lot of damage right here. Um, these things are a little bit more enthusiastic than I remember. I don't have a target. Go on. And there, right. Well, at least we've got several of those in. We've got six of eight now. We need two more. But they they are very enthusiastic, aren't they? I don't remember them being quite that enthusiastic. Another energized geode right there. And we'll sit down and we'll have a bowl of succulent orca stew. And we'll also... What else have we got? We've got a scroll of strength. That's about it, really. I've used up all the rest of the things I took out of the guild bank. Let's have that one. There. All right, well, we might go and have a look in the guild bank in a bit. And we'll see if we've got any more tasty treats in there. Things that will help us out. And... I'll go over this way. Ah, there. I see I've got one over there, but uh, I need one more, don't I? So if I go and grab that energized geode in there, and I grab him up there, he's going to draw me in with his fatal attraction. Is that fatal attraction? Pretty sure he said fatal attraction. So we'll, we'll do that. Oh, you know what? It would help if we summoned up that one. <laughs> just in time. Literally just in time on there. And we'll take out energized geode. Okay. One quest down. Several more to go. And I quite, I do quite like the story under here. I, I like the whole idea that we've got... This is where... Um, what's his name? The, the, the big bad guy. Dreadwing. This is where Dreadwing was imprisoned for millennia. He was down here. And then they freed him. Go and have a look at the... Go on to YouTube. Uh, you, you're probably on YouTube already if you're watching this video. Um, yeah, funny that. Um, go and search up the Cataclysm uh, trailer and watch that and you'll see Dreadwing in Deep Home. It's a very, very cool video. There is no denying that that is a very, very cool video. Right, I'm going to go... I got two up there, I got two up there, and then we've got this one. So let's, let's go to Goldmine first. We'll head over this way. We'll speak to him, and then we will head out from this bit. Right, he's... Oh, he's right here among the rock players. Okay, well, we've got, we've got to remove these rock players then. If we've done that, we can we can speak to Initiate Goldmine. He's... 
he's helping us out a little bit. Ooh, we got a green. Okay, right. Makes sense. Makes sense. Hiya, lend a hand, would you, bub? Oh, sure, she said. It'll be a simple trip out into the wastes. This guy's the son of the earthen leader. He almost made it to the temple when he got ambushed by more rock flares than I can count. We know that the earthen stone father has the middle fragment of the world pillar. Maybe if we were to heal his son, the stone father would give us the fragment. My heels won't work on flint here, but if we were to get some of the quartzite re resin off of these monsters, I think I could make an explosive compound that will bond and cauterize his wounds. I need to move it. Move it. Don't waste my time. Don't waste my time. There are, it's kind of a New York accent for these guys, isn't it? It's a strong New York accent, I think. Um, not that I'm probably not getting it very good, but I do try. I'm never very good with regional accents from the US. I'm much better with um, regional accents from the UK and parts of Europe, but um, some, well, so, I think so. Some people may call that into question as well. But anyway, uh, all right, we need something that's going to make the compound go boom. I'm all out of gunpowder, but I think I know what we can use instead. The heart of my fire elemental. Here, take my fire totem east to the blood trail. Just flip the switch on it near any of the lava pools out over there, and Magma Tooth should be summoned. Bring back his heart, and we'll be in business. On your way. On your way. Right, we need to get the burning heart. Let's go and do that a minute. Let's just run over there and do that. Uh, wait, I want this one. And quartzite resin. Is that from those guys? Yeah, that's from those guys. Okay. So I, I want to go this way for the burning heart. And then we want to come back and we'll get the, the quartzite resin. We'll do that in a minute. Now, somewhere around here, you can see you, there's a very rare spawn of a, a dragon in here. And that very rare spawn, it, will, it drops a mount. If you can get that very rare spawn, you get onto its back and you fight it or something, um, and, and then you get the mount. But there's always people down here waiting for it, and it's got like a three or four day spawn timer on it. It's um, those kind of super rare spawns. They're ones that I assume that I'm never ever going to get. I just that's that's just an assumption I make. And you see here we're on what's called the blood trail. This is to do with Deathwing escaping. We've got living blood over here. So we'll take out this living blood right there. As soon as we've taken that one down, we can do the burning heart. We need to use gold mines fire totem in any of the lava pools within the blood trail. So that would be that one right there. Requires this lava pool. There we go. Right. To stand in it. Deep home. I hate this place. You're not initiate gold mine. I, can't attack that. I know what you're after. I can sense it. That is no, this is not in my contract. Die, human. Uh, right. This, is, this might be why gold mine sent us to go and do this rather than him doing it himself. Because uh, he doesn't seem happy about the, the fact that we're doing this at all, does he? Right. He's, he's, mind you. Someone turned up telling me that they wanted to rip my heart out of my chest and it's use it for, uh, you know, th their own purposes. No! You tell Goldmine he's a dead goblin. Our contract is over. Alright. He's an elemental, so just because we've killed him on this plane, I don't think that necessarily means that he's dead altogether. Yeah, uh, we'll, we'll keep that in mind. Right, I'm going to go after these rock flares a minute. And we're going to see if we can get the I need to get quartzite closer. stuff that we want. So there's you, and there's you, and then there's you. Right, let's do that down there. And then that one over there. I'm hoping I can get all of these guys all at once. There. Like that. Now, we, we chuck them all down like this, and then we will do the Avenging Wrath. Such a cool. I love this move. I really love it. I really, really love this move. Okay, and then we do that, and then... Uh, oh, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually heal up. No, I didn't want Flash of Light. I wanted Hand of the Protector. There. That would be the one to use. 
And then shields. Now, is this 100% drop rate? Or are we going to need to kill a lot of these? Two. This is not a 100% drop rate. I was hoping that, you know, we'd get five for five. Apparently not. You got to look. You, you have a look at the way that they've done this zone. See? Gravity is not really doing what you'd expect it to, is it? Right, you got these stones. You got stuff floating all over the place. Like, literally, over the entire zone, it's, it's like this. It's away. not just in one place. Everything is, is just slightly out of whack and out of sync. And, and things are not as they should be. Things are not as they would normally appear. Let's drop that there. And then I'm going to go over to you. And I'm going to pull that one in. And then you down there. I'm going to... I was going to talk to you. I don't actually need to. I'm going to put that down like that. I'm going to see if I can get you up there. Yes, I can. I can pull that one in. I can do some more of this. And then I'm going to turn around like that. And I'm just going to back up a little bit. There. Throw in a shield. You know I'm going to need to heal up a little bit. There we go. Uh, do that again. You know I probably should have yelled Grundorn for this. It's a bit late now. You, you can't go and yell a Grundorn Jenkins moment right at the end. It just doesn't work. Right, it, it doesn't play out. Ah, there we go. Right, I've, I've managed to heal. I did manage to heal. It's all okay. I thought for a moment I wasn't going to be able to make it. Put that down. And then shield on both of them and we got those two as well. Excellent. One? Seriously? And I can't even harvest these for goods. For, for, for materials. Can't. It, it won't let me harvest them. And I only got one. Out of all of those, I got one. I'm, I'm feeling a bit... Whoa. Okay. I vote we leave that guy alone. You know, considering that he's uh, an angry-looking dude. Um, I'm out of range. I can't reach that one up there. Fine. I got that one down there. I got. I, I do have one over there I can reach. And I got another one over there. Let's uh, put that down. I need to get closer. Let's take you... And you over there. Let's taunt you in. Right. Have we got any more? I got one up here. Go on, let's do this. Let me do that and that. Grundorn Jenkins. <laughs> right, round this way. We back up a little bit there. We oh, now we're talking. Right, we've got six of these bad boys. And we should be able to take them out really quick with uh, this one. You've reached level 88. Ha, <laughs> ha. Told you it wouldn't take long to do that. We got two levels to go. And then we got so we gotta decide. Like I said before, I want in the comments section this week. Do you want me to stay here leveling this? And now now we get now we get them. Four all all at once. Yeah. Yeah. That, 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 that's that's just great, isn't it? That, that's just great. Okay, fine. We'll leave that behind. Do you want me to stay here and play this entire region? Or do you want me to just stay here until we reach level 90? Get into the comment section and let me know. I want to hear your feedback on this. You few, you happy few who watch this series. Go! Go! Go? Well, careful just... out there. Careful out there. Quickly! Quickly! Come on, quickly! It won't take much resin. Those rock flayers are pretty dangerous, though. Good thing <laughs> I just have... You're laughing at me. Good thing I just happen to be a grand master of all things explosively alchemical. This won't ignite on its own, though. You have the heart yet? Uh-oh. Sounds like he wasn't very happy about the situation. <laughs> How was I to know? I'm just an initiate, after all. Anyway, I'll worry about Magma Tooth later. All right. Take this and apply it to his wounds. If the cauterizing effect of the flash dry explosion doesn't crack him wide open... It should be completely heal him, I think. Hit the road. Hit the road. Why? Right. Don't yap at me. Use the explosive Careful bonding compound on Flint. Well, I was trying to. Flint or mantle right there. We need to use that. You must drop everything that you're doing to help me free my father, our leader, the Stone Father. Go! Go! Looks like that did it. He should come to any moment now. I told you I was a grand master of alchemy. I've got some extra resin left over. I can make it into all kinds of explosively wonderful stuff. What do you want? 
He's still looking a little loopy to me. His head must still be ringing. Best get him inside the temple and see what the Earth Caller wants to do with him. I'm th I think I'm going to stay out here a little while longer and observe these rock flayers. On your way. On your way. I'm ready to meet with your so-called Earth Caller. The war between the Earthen and the Stone Trogs has raged for time beyond measure. But now in the chaos, the Stone Father Prisoner... But now in the chaos... They are threatening to kill him if we do not surrender. We must hurry and speak with your Earthen Ring friends. Right. Let us go then. We will go and speak to him. We will go and deal with the other quests in a minute. We want to go in here and uh, I feel like we really should do this quickly. The only thing that matters is that we'd rescue my father. So we drop down into here. Uh, I'll speak to Sia Oh, wait a minute. See you. Ah, this is one. I demand that you send aid to Stonehearth. Help us with our war to free Stonefather or Mantle. This one assisted me. This one that assisted me should be adequate. Have them report to our force commander, Crag Rockcrusher, at Stonehearth. He's a bit rude, really, isn't he? I've just saved your life, dude. Good fortune. We are honoured by Flint Ormandel's presence. I am given to understand that the Stonefather is in possession of a fragment of the World Pillar. It is imperative that we recover all of the fragments. The instability between worlds is increasing. Soon it may become too great even for mighty Thrall to hold at bay. The Irvin and the Stone Trogs somehow found their way to Deep Home through Oldham more than 15,000 years ago. They've been warring ever since. If we're to recover the middle fragment of the World Pillar, the Stone Father must be rescued. Please go to Stonehearth and do everything you can to aid the Earthen in their war against the Stone Trogs. You are our best hope, Grundorn. Do not lose faith. Do not lose faith. Live another day. Thank you, Grundorn. We need all the power we can muster to keep Deep Home stable. That's a two-handed one. I don't want go that. Go on, then. Go on, then. Right, so we've got the gunship Stonehearth's aid fly over Master's Gate. Uh, Master's Gate plans. We go to that one next. Master's Gate and the Master's Gate plans, which is up over here. And then we've got the, the wreck of the ship that we want to go over that way and we want to explore over there, at least in theory. Right, this, these guys here, Twilight Hammer, these, these guys are like proper psychos, okay? That they want the end of the, the... Basically, what they're after is that they want the end of the world. This is the Master's Gate. That is what these guys are after. They want the end of the world and the destruction of humankind. And it's a very weird thing to desire. I don't know why they desire... Ooh, wait, what's this? Do I like Cryptomancer? There's a... There's an actual gate here. Twilight's hammer has unearthed a Titan Waygate, and it appears that they're attempting to activate it. Well, unfortunately, I'm going to have to interrupt things here because that is all we've got time for today. So if you've enjoyed this episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.